A spectacular sight from the Space Coast, SpaceX launches its Falcon Heavy rocket and the world was not disappointed. Just minutes after a successful liftoff, all three cores of that rocket landed the mission, a major step for the company. News 6's Eric Sandoval was there with thousands of others witnessing history. SpaceX has its eyes set on sending a rocket up with humans on board later on this year. But tonight, all eyes here were to the north. Because for a lot of people here in Jetty Park, this was their first launch to see in real life. Yay! Now in time for launch. Woohoo! Cheryl Boudreau came all the way from New Orleans. I see something. I see something. Is that it? Yep. <laughs> Check it out. She waited two days here at Jetty Park in Cape Canaveral for this. SpaceX launched its Falcon Heavy rocket from historic launch pad 39A. The most powerful rocket on Earth right now, it was carrying an Arab communication satellite into orbit. SpaceX tweeting this photo of it being deployed tonight. <laughs> On Earth, Boudreaux and her family were in a sea of people watching and waiting for two of the three rocket boosters to return and land right in front of them. <laughs> I forgot about that. Accompanied by that sonic boom. Happy Fourth of July! Tonight, SpaceX founder Elon Musk tweeted this message from the entire team saying they love NASA. And Boudreaux says, she agrees. It came down. It was like something Disney World would do. It didn't even look real. It was awesome. Now we checked and SpaceX and Boeing are targeting a date later on this summer to send those astronauts back into space. And if tonight is any indication, a lot of people are going to be right here to see it happen. We're in Jetty Park tonight. Eric Sandoval getting results. New six. I want to hang out with Miss Boudreaux. Love her enthusiasm. Like fun. <laughs> also on tap for SpaceX. A first of its kind mission today, NASA selected the company for its launch to deflect an asteroid. Big day, the mission involving a Falcon 9 rocket is expected in June of 2021.